to today's video. Today we'll be taking a look at Qantas's business class long haul amenity kit. First off, you can see that it is a beautiful color. On the tag, I don't know if you can see, but it has the Qantas Roo logo on the tag. Once again, just a beautiful outside bag. Moving inside, you can see it is packed. First off, this is one of the many amenity kits Qantas is making with special artists around Australia. This one is made by Megan Weston, creator of the Iceland amenity kit, which is this one. We'll keep that one there for now. Here, we have an eye mask with the same design as the amenity kit, which is quite nice, but once again, like the United Business Class and IMOS, it's not as nice as Saudi's economy, which is quite surprising. We'll take a bit closer look at those in another video though. Here are the socks. The socks are rather disappointing since they don't even have grips and they're made of the same quite cheap sock material. But nonetheless, they're quite thick and quite warm. We'll keep those there. Here we have an Aspar lotions and potions kit. Their quote is relax, hydrate, and travel essentials. Let's open this up. Here you can have ultra hydrating moisturizer. Sweet orange lip balm. And lastly, oops, sweet orange and shea hand cream. All in this lovely little box. There we go. Now, you also have one earplug and a toothbrush and toothpaste. All once again quite cheap and plasticky, but by far the biggest bottle of toothpaste I've ever seen any airline provide. So that, if you like minty teeth, then this will definitely be on your side. There we go. And that's it. Inside the amenity kit, you can also find who it's made by, as well as a Qantas logo. All in all, it was a good amenity kit, but it was just definitely lacking some quality in some of the areas, as it made it feel cheap and plasticky as it was, but you wouldn't expect this on a five-star airline. This is what's inside the Qantas Long Haul Amenity Kit. Thanks for watching.